Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Live. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be super helpful video guys to any of you having a Ford C-Max, Ford Fusion, Lincoln, MKZ guys. If you have one of those, you have check engine light on and any of the following two codes such as code P2270 and code P2271. Stay with us, we'll explain what most likely causes that, how to fix it, why we mentioned these three vehicles because uh, all three vehicles share the same drivetrain, the same engines guys. So if you have a hybrid or non-hybrid, it will work for both. Make sure to stay until the end and we'll explain how we can test the sensor that's causing that problem as well. Before we start, let me tell you a little bit about us guys. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. Why we do that? Simply because our mission at the shop is to save you as much money as we can. All we need in return, please subscribe to the channel and like the video, that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos. Another thing, if you want to save quite a bit of money on car parts, tools, uh, anything for your car guys, check out the link in the description of the video below, that's where we get all our tools and supplies from. So, let's go ahead and start on it now. So let's go ahead, open the hood and we want to show you what we have specifically here guys. This is uh, the engine, this is a hybrid engine, but uh, when we remove the upper engine cover, practically it's a regular 2.0 engine guys. The hybrid part is practically just on the passenger side right there. So uh, it's practically uh, the same thing guys. If you have that code on a non-hybrid vehicle, it will work as well. So. On these uh, modern vehicles guys, on four cylinder engines, you most likely will have two oxygen sensors. The first one is known as upstream oxygen sensor or bank one, sensor one. It detects how much air and fuel you still have in the exhaust system. It's right located right before the catalytic converter guys. Okay, right there. You can see it's right before the catalytic converter. Let's go move a little bit so we can brighten it a little bit. Okay, perfect. And it's going to detect how much fuel air you have it will send that to the engine computer the engine computer will determine okay do we need to add more fuel do we need to uh, add less fuel maybe to have less fuel in the system so we have nice clean running engine then we have uh, downstream oxygen sensor another oxygen sensor or known as uh, bank uh, one sensor two guys it's all the way on the bottom under the vehicle let me show you okay where it's located okay it should be right after the catalytic converter so if you look this is the catalytic converter the upstream oxygen sensor is the one with the blue wire that goes to the top the downstream is right after the catalytic converter and we're talking about that sensor right there what it does it detects if the catalytic converter is doing its job so first if you have called p2270 I would recommend guys, okay, it could be bad oxygen sensor, bad wiring harness or disconnected oxygen sensor and it connects right here next to the CV axle right there. So that's very likely as well guys. Uh, if you have uh, code P2271, check those, thing three, uh, those three things again, bad sensor, burnt wire, broken wire or disconnected connector guys. But what else can cause these codes? Something completely different guys. So let me get up and I will show you now. Let's open the hood quick. It could be guys, okay, P2270 means that it's stuck clean. Stuck clean means that uh, practically the engine is getting more air than fuel and that can be caused by multiple things. One is vacuum leak. Uh, that's uh, extra air the engine is getting but he doesn't know of so vacuum leak right after the uh, mass airflow sensor anything like loose holes uh, intake manifold gaskets uh, purge control valve brake lines vacuum lines booster lines all those can cause vacuum leaks number two okay it could be dirty fuel injector fuel injector guys okay that's not working correctly not spraying enough fuel it will not spray enough fuel it will end up having a lean fuel mixture so that needs to be addressed as well. If you have code P2271, it means rich fuel mixture. In that way, guys, what could cause that? Again, we said, check, it could be most likely bad oxygen sensor, but it could be uh, a leaking fuel injector that sprays more fuel, and as a result, that will cause rich fuel mixture. Dirty air filter that will not allow enough air to go to the engine. As a result, you have rich fuel mixture okay or total body that's, that's not functioning correctly in some cases can cause that as well if you need to test oxygen sensor we have the video on our main youtube channel how to repair guys check it out and it will teach you how to do that hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching and see you guys next time